Hello guys and girls and welcome back to City Skylines Park Life with me Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me in the last couple of episodes. We worked on this park here right at the start of our city and we've managed so far to get this thing upgraded to three stars and it's almost at the fourth one. We're just needing some more visitors. We've got plenty of entertainment level. I am again going to put this down to zero to try and encourage as many people as possible to move in here. So today we're going to expand our city a little bit more. Things are going okay. Everybody's happy. 3.2 thousand people, which is good. Money is rolling in. And we've got plenty of electricity. Uh, plenty of, yeah, the water's okay. The electricity, not so much. We haven't unlocked anything other than the coal power plant at the minute. And he seems to be outputting not a huge amount. Uh, once we get something a bit better... Oh, we've got underground power lines now. You'll be so glad. Uh, we'll go for something else when we can. But at the moment, we're sort of making do with what we've got. So I would like to put in here, if we can, a sort of a lake area. And I'm thinking... We might move some stuff around. I'm thinking this area over here could be quite good for a lake area. Now, as it stands, with some of these assets, you don't seem to be able to select them to move them. These parts you can, but like the assets, once you, once you put them down, uh, like I'm hovering over them, there's no opportunity to select them. So I am going to use the Move It mod, and we are going to move some of these things because... Um, where we, I th I'm thinking of like putting a lake in this half over here. So the things that can't be moved, let's just shift them over to this side for now. There we go. What we could do is do this. We'll select that. Shift them over there. We'll grab these. Shift them over there. What have we got here? No. <laughs> Don't want to take everything. Can I just grab those two? Yes. There we go. We'll move those over there. Welcome to all the new subscribers as well. I see a lot of you have subscribed. You found my videos because of the Park Life uh, DLC that we're looking at. And I uh, welcome you to my channel. Thank you very much for subscribing. We're going to move that. Let's just pop that over there for now. And then we're going to delete this. So yeah, welcome. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for joining me. Uh, we're going to get rid of that tree. And yeah, we're going to see if we can dig this down a bit in here. So let's see. Let's see. If we take that brush strength, we need that all the way down to low. Okay, I think we will go with that. Let's add the water in and see how this looks. So this is always the fun bit. Let's make that nice and small. That can go there. And then if we get the level right... Let's grab that and bring that down. Okay, here we go. So we want the level up to where it's not going to overflow everywhere. Probably about there, I reckon. Let's unpause and see what happens. Hopefully that's okay. Here it comes. Here it comes. Let's just make sure that's going to be nice and okay. Is it going to fill up all the way around here? Yep, looks like it. Yeah, it looks okay. I might sort of level this bit out. We might put some rocks and things over there. We've got like a bit of a slope so we can walk down there if they like. Excellent. There we go. So what I would like to do is see if we can put, and I'm pretty sure we can, like one of these paths. We're going to do this one here over the top. And it will make a bridge. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Does that look nice or what? Got the grass sort of coming through there. I don't know why. But I'm liking that. And uh, maybe we could sort of get rid of that grass. Hmm. Let's see if we can. If I go... Let's select that. Nope. Let's do this one. Let's select that. It's like, no, you're going to have grass and you're going to have to deal with it. Okay. Well, that's fine. We'll get some maintenance men in to deal with that. But I'm liking that a lot. So I'm thinking maybe we could have another bridge sort of coming over here. So if we select... And come out of that menu. There we go. If we select this here, what if we could do it? I don't think the tree one is gonna do anything other than yeah, it's gonna do the same sort of bridge. Hmm, this one doesn't want to do it. It's gonna build it up. Well, that's a shame. <laughs> um, I wonder why that is. So it'll connect over there. Oh, there we go. Let's do that instead. That's fine. Yeah, people can walk across there. 
What about over here? Oh, yeah, look. Here we go. Let's have one across there. Oh, I'm suddenly really liking this. I am suddenly really liking that. Do I want another one here? Maybe we're, I'm just we're suddenly wondering whether the whole of this centre could be a lake or maybe just that half. Let's stick with that half because I'll tell you why. We do have these couple here. Now, how big are these? Park Pier. So that Park Pier could actually go in there. Uh -huh. People can come out. And there's like enough room for like one table on there. Look, <laughs> whoever gets there first can eat on there. And then we've got the other one as well, which is Park Pier number two. That is actually a lot bigger. So I'll tell you what we'll do. We're going to move this one to over here. And it's going to line up a bit wonky, isn't it? Let's just see how that goes. Yeah, I am going to use the Move It mod here so we can shift this around and get it to line up how we want it to line up which is right up against that there we go excellent that perfect perfect and then we'll get the larger of the two there we go pier park two and i'm hoping that will go nicely right there how does that look that, that <laughs> i like the look of that that looks pretty cool so you can walk out there Sit on the sit on the end. I don't think you're going to do any fishing, are you? But you're certainly going to enjoy the view. And then we've got the paths coming across there as well. Sudden and a bit of flooding. Suddenly, that's, that's changed that area entirely, isn't it? With that water area there. That is looking really good. That is looking really good. Let's have a look at our facts and figures. Our entertainment is going up. 12,000 or 1,200 attractiveness. And we're creeping up towards... The next level with the people. I'm going to leave. I'm just wondering whether. Hmm, if we could have the water come through there. We could have a massive bridge. But then that wouldn't connect with it. Let's leave it like that. Let's let's leave it like that. I'm liking it. So let's speed things up. Let's keep things going at full speed. Uh, apparently there are roundabouts. Roundabouts. There's roundabouts on my traffic lights. There's traffic lights on my roundabouts. Yeah, these are all going to go. That was my bad. Um, I don't want to stop there. I want them to give way. But we'll probably just let them work it out for themselves. Traffic isn't so bad. So that's good. What have we got a need for? We do have a need for some more industry. Now, from playing this a lot, because I have got so many hours in this game, we know that natural resources give us a ton of money. We do have natural resources in here. We could make this all change into farm area. How far out does our square go? Oh, it literally only goes up to there. Hmm, I was hoping we could suddenly run out and grab some trees. We could put farming here. Have a little road come out, change all that to farming. And have like a farming district. So basically, it's all of this. Is available for farming by the look of it. Let's just... Without the mods, I can't put both on at once. Yeah, that is just about... We go out slightly wider. And then it comes down here as well. I mean, it does, of course, cover that. But I don't want to suddenly get rid of all of that. And that is Chester Heights. That could be a little mini farming district. Maybe not all the way down here. But let's see how that goes. So let us grab this road. This is our main road that we're using at the moment. May as well go... What's that going to cost us? 8,000? We've got 104,000 or something. Let us chuck that in. What is the next? Busy town, 5,500. We'll get all sorts of things. All sorts of things. Okay, we'll look at that when we get to it. Do we actually have the farming we do? So if we make that farming, and then I'm going to grab the small one, and we're going to get rid of that down the middle there. Whoops. There we go. Get rid of all of that. So that is our farming district. So where can we build off of there? I'm thinking maybe we'll build across here and here and have a little farming district in the middle. How does that sound? Sounds good to me. That'll be this road. So if we come across, say, we will connect somewhere down here at some point. But at the moment, we shall go with this. Now, we've got to be careful of pollution. I don't want that to infringe upon my farm at all. So let's check the pollution. I think we're okay. I've, I've got the ground pollution turned off. But I think we're going to be okay. 
out. Let's just slightly make that a little bit bigger to there. Now, we may not even take all of that, but we're definitely going to take all of this. So, I'll tell you what we're going to do is let's connect this road up. Now, we might as well have this district take up all of this space. There we go. We'll take all of that as well. Oh, auto save. I have to have the auto saves on quite a lot. Because, I think I mentioned this before, some mod or another is causing some issues. So, let us go with these. And I'm going to line them up to here. And let's just go straight across and get as much farming in here as we can. There we go. We'll get those connected. I'm just wondering, actually, if we alternate those. So, we'll have that connect that side. There we go, that one connect that side, and we'll do that just to sort of space out the junctions a bit. So we haven't got too much problem with traffic all too near each other. There we go, can I fit one more in there? No, this is obviously not far enough down. So let's do that. There we go, excellent. And we'll just make this slightly larger. Not quite sure where that's going to need to go. There, there we go, we'll do that. You connect to there. No, okay, maybe not. You go like that. You connect to there. Good and good. There we go. Excellent. Let us get some water pipes and such in here. Our water is looking a-okay, which is what I want to see. Mm, yeah, let's run that one up here. And along there. And then we'll go down some of these. So we'll go down that one and this one. And then, how's that? Yeah, we do need a lot of industry. So, hopefully, got it set to farm. Yeah, hopefully we're going to see a load of farms move in. If we take... I'm going to go for this area here. They're going to need power. Let's use our first underground power cable. Let's see where they move in first. If we stick a power cable there, is that going to connect both together? Yeah, excellent. Hurrah, there we go. That's what we want to see. We want to see farming and all that lovely stuff. Get some farms in, baking company, beef cakes, juice press. Excellent. So let's just close that one down there. Let's just check this here. Yeah, I think these here are going to be more of the farms and these will be more of the processing. We're sort of overlapping a little bit with the trees there, aren't we? I'm wondering whether actually we could... Do a little something here. If we take that out there. Whoa. If we take this one out here like that. We're going to change this. Let's pause. Let's do that again. I'm going to take this one out. And this is going to be. This is going to be trees. Oh, come on game. Come on game. Let me line it up how I want to line it up. Thank you kindly. There we go. Brywood Heights and Chester Heights. This over here. Oh, we don't have forestry yet, do we? Forest industry. Yes, we do. There we go. We're going to make that forest. And then we'll get some more farms in here. They're obviously moving in at the speed of light. There we go. Excellent. How's electricity going? A bit low. Our budget is... We're going to max that out. Let's max this one out. Well, let's put this at 100% actually. There we go. So we want to keep an eye on this. Normal industry, farming we've got coming in and forestry. And that will start making us more money. There we go. I don't think there's any problem mixing these two up either. That's quite good. Right. We need to expand. Let's get some more people in. People are loving moving in here. And then we're going to have to check our services and stuff. Uh, we're a bit short, I think, on some services. I've had to put in... Did I put it in? Yes, there we go. I've put in a landfill site. Because this thing down here, for some reason, was only sending out, like, one truck. I don't know why. Oh, how's, this, how's the park going? How's the park going? Oh, we're going to be getting up to level five, like, any minute. Uh, level four. I can't count, obviously. Uh, that's not quite long enough. Let us make that up to there. There we go. Let's try and get in as many people as we can. Let's get that one there. So we fill in all of this. I'm pretty sure we've almost got all the pipes sorted. So let's do that. There we go. That one and this one. 
And then we need, definitely need to check services and schools and all that sort of stuff. So if we go like that. And then we're going to need some shops. I'm thinking commercial along here. There we go. Move in, move in. Excellent. That's what we want to see. 3,700 and growing. Nice. I love Yay, congratulations! Level 4 in Monk Park. We now have the climbing frames. Number 1. Maha, let's check that out. Let's add... So let's have a look at our park here. We need to switch around some things here, don't we? We've got gazebo number 2. Where could I... Oh, look, we can actually have that off the side of the path. Oh, and that'll fit right there. How's that going to work? Are they going to be able to actually get into that? Well, they seem to... Be able to, yes, and they seem to like it as well. Although, to me, that should be facing that way. Let's try and move that again. Oh, um, yes, it will go that way. There we go, that's better. Unhappy, then happy again. Whoa, come on, camera, you can do it. Yeah, that's good. We'll have that one there. And we've got our bushes and flower beds and sand pit and all that sort of thing to move around. I'll probably... Just do all of that off camera. But let's just put our ice cream van back in. There we go. And there we go. Actually, I might as well do these now while we're here. We'll have the sand pits here for the kitty winkies. There we go. We've got the benches for the parents watching the kitty winkies. Let's grab these ones together. We'll turn those around. Oh, there we go. Let's grab that and... Can I move it, please? Oi, that's... Three times. Oh, there we go. Excellent. And then the flowers are sorted out another time. That's fine. Good. There we go. Oh, man. Look at that. There's like one one bench, one table and bench, and the old guy's like hogging it, and everyone else is like, yes, please. We want to come and... Oh, and they're using this as well. What are they doing on here? Oh, they're loving it. They are loving it. Oh, man. I'm so glad to see so many people coming in. Now, I had a question. Can you add into these... Um, normal park stuff. You know, the normal stuff you'd have before park life. Let's just move that out of the way. Well, let's do a test. So if we go into here and check, so our normal parks here, uh, park with trees, one of these is quite small. Where's the small one? I thought that was this one. It's this one, but the park, yes, it is this one. We could add it in if we had the space. Can we... Must be placed roadside. Oh, I see, because we've got the fence going round. So it can't be placed against the path. So actually, the answer could be no. It doesn't go in here. Unless we had a road coming in. So it sort of separates out the new park stuff with the old park stuff. But we actually do need some parks down here. Because that park's giving the bonus around there. Do we have... I reckon this section here... What do you reckon to a fairground park? Like right in the middle of this section... I think that would be super cool. And I've also... Ooh, electricity. I've also downloaded a load of cool mods uh, that might help us with that. So, um, yeah, let's... We're going to have to go for another coal power plant over here. We're going to put that on this side. Just to try and keep that going. How's the industry? Industry's growing well. They've got some space. Let's give them another spot there. There we go. Yeah, we may remove these guys... Okay, let's just check the coverage of everything else. So, how are you doing? So, you're all the way over there. Yep, let's give you guys some coverage down here. Let's squeeze you in the side there. Yep. Death care coverage. Do we have that at all? Crematoriums and cemeteries, we do not. Now, do I want to place that right here? Because we're going to have our park... In this area. That's what we've decided we're going to do. I'm going to put that there. It's covering everywhere, so that's okay. Fire coverage. We've got that one over there, but nothing much over here. Let's put these guys on the main road. Oh, no. That's going to be... <laughs> I've said it like a thousand times. They can go there. This is going to be our park, so I'm not going to cover that up. Police is down there. We'll put another one up here. This is going to start helping people to upgrade, which is what we want. Schools. There we go. So... This school, we need another school. Which one did we go for there? Yeah, the normal elementary school. 
I think for over here, we're going to go for the community school, the eco school. Because it looks very cool. And we're going to slide that one in there. Yep. Yeah. That fits in nicely. There we go. We will get some eco stuff in as well. Don't worry. Excellent. Very good. Okay. So that's about it, isn't it? And the high school is fine. Do we have buses and transport yet? We do. Oh, the other question was, can you place Metro inside the park? We don't know yet. But I would like, I think, a tram. This road up and down here would be perfect for a tram, wouldn't it? If we upgrade to six-lane road with tram, we'd still be the same size. What else have we got? Four-lane road with tram. That would put the tram in the middle. So you'd still have the four-lane. But you'd have the tram going up and down here. Can I upgrade to this type? That's because it's already is this type. Then it could go down there and across into the business area and back round again. Oh, yeah, that would be perfect. Yep. Let's add some trams. And then I'll show you some of the mods that I've got. Oh, I don't have the auto bulldozing mod, I don't think. Nah, turn that off. So I'll have to keep an eye on that myself. Yeah, that's far enough away from the junction there not to cause any issues. And then up here. Is this the right one? Yes, that's the one, isn't it? Yep. Nice. So they can go down there. They can loop around and come back up again. Perfect. So where would we put our tram depot? We seem to have a nice little spot in this area in here. And that would fit in there perfectly. Yep. Attaches to the tram lines. Let's give it its own bit of space. There we go. Excellent. Let's put some tram lines in. There we go. I don't think we're going to need... Oh, yeah, we're going to need a turny round spot on the end, aren't we? How close to the end of our thing are we? Where are we likely to buy another square? I'm not entirely sure yet. So maybe let us just take this out to there. And then what have we got? One-way tram tracks. So they're going up the right. So if we go like this... Go there to there and sort of eyeball eyeball it the size. There we go, and they can turn around. Yep, excellent. That's good. So where should we have our tram go? I mean, if it starts here. Okay, we'll go around that side. And already they're upgrading. Look, they're like, yep, yeah, we're happy. We've got the tram. Um, there, there, and then we're going to go in this way. Yes, we'll go in this way. So there, past the junction, by the business. I don't want tram tracks too close together. Although it's not too bad where they are. And try and keep them back from a junction. And I want that one past the junction. Yeah, let's go past the junction. So that into the park. And then we'll go up the other side of the road here. Yep, that's fine. And then we'll mirror these ones. And then we'll connect it up there. Excellent. Everybody's so happy. Yay, we have trams. Where's our tram? Let's... Ah, oh, here it comes. Oh, this is the one. I like these trams here. Look at these. These are very cool. The Alstom Citadas 302. You can search for those yourself on the workshop. Which way is he going to go? Any way would be nice. Here he goes. He's off. Oh, he's picking up some people, is he? I don't know. And also, as long as they're not too far from junctions, they can use the uh, crossing as well. Well, people can use the crossing to get across. You know what I mean? Excellent. That is really going to help with the traffic. What we want to do as well is remove some of these. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. There's not enough people. We put in too much industry all at once. It's growing again now. Everybody here okay? Yeah, everybody's okay. Good, good. Oh, man, we have a huge need for people. Flipping heck. How about some high-density houses at the back here? I think that might be nice. Or should we go for high-density in the middle? Now, let's go for high-density here. As this is more sort of... Yeah, city centre type stuff. Let's... Yeah, take out all of that and change it. Take out all of that and change it. And that. There we go. 
see the people moving in and out of that. Oh, I did completely the same colour. We don't have identity yet. Okay, no identity then. <laughs> My bad. So what I'm actually going to do is I am going to put in here some of that. And we're going to remove these ones. Because this is going to be the start of our amusement park area. So if we get our new paint a park area magnolia meadows right we need to name this after one of my patreons thank you very much for supporting me on patreon if you're able to do so and one of the perks is getting your name mentioned in a video so let me find uh one of my patrons and we'll rename this okay here we go this is gonna be lotax or what's it i'll put lotax park for now but i want a different name on the end there because this is going to be an amusement park so let me know what you think. What is that there? Oh, it's somebody who hasn't left yet. Could you go? Thank you very much. We're doing other things here. Excellent. Thank you very much for your support on Patreon. Um, if you wish to do the same for as little as one cup of tea a month, you can get all sorts of goodies for yourself and support my channel as well, which I do really, really appreciate. So thank you very much. I'm going to remove all the trees from in there in Lotax. What should we call it? Lotax what? Hmm. Give me some ideas. What can we call it? Lotax Amusement Park? Lotax something. I don't know. Let's build this thing and then we'll we'll see what we're going to end up calling it. So, this is going to be like a bit of a castle in here. So, let us have a look at what we've got. So I'm not quite sure how we're going to set this out. But, let's find the name. Here we go. So, we've got some medieval walls. Aha, uh -huh. short walls, I want long walls, here we go, we've got all sorts of stuff, tall wall, four cells, yeah, what else have we got, we've got little towers, we've got wall ads, oh man, there's so much stuff, now who is it that makes these, and I'll search by their name instead, they are made by, well I've absolutely no idea, but let's have a look at some of these things, so if we put down for instance, let's open the park first, so this is going to be an amusement park, we need amusement park main gate, which is going to go, hmm, let's see, I reckon down this side somewhere, maybe, maybe there, and it's got to give them some, give us some room to build in, whoa, Lotax has reached park level one, he's now unlocked all these other amusement park things, oh my goodness me, there's so many things on there, excellent. Right, so we'll keep that open there. And then if we go back to this one, we've got our main gate. I wish I had the toggle whiteness mod working. That would be nice. And then we put prop and tree anarchy on. I was hoping that would go over the top of there. Let's run this path a little bit longer. Hmm, I wonder whether it's to flatten that out a bit. Let's see anyway whether we can put that over the top. Yes, we can. Can I do it with prop and tree anarchy off? I can as well. Is it going to remove the path? It looks like that's going to remove the path. Let's put it down and see. Yes, it is. Oh, that's annoying. Let's see if I can put the path back in again. Now that prop and tree anarchy is on. No. If we put this here, and then if I move it mod this over the top. Aha! There we go. We found a way to do it. So now we have the castle. Whoa, I'm moving the wrong thing. Let's grab this. There we go. Now we have the castle gate that we're going to go into. In fact, that'll be okay. If we leave it all at this level, I might actually just flatten this out a bit. Yep, there we go. It's almost like put a nice little sort of hill in the middle here. So that's going to suit our castle well. Let us move it this back over the top then. So that can be the entrance. Um, and let's check out some of the other pieces that we've got as well. Where is it? This one here. So we've got all sorts of gates and walls and turrets do you want a couple of turrets at the beginning yeah, i think we're going to be having to move it mod all of this stuff aren't we to get it into place so let us let's put these down and see what we've got and then we can always copy and move them so let's get ourselves a little pallet going where should we put it let's put it right at the end of the park out the way so we've got one of those one of those let's put our turrets and towers down here there we go Okay, there we go. This is the sort of stuff we've got. So I'm thinking at the beginning, right next to that gate, we want something like this. Is that like a half tower? What's the other side look like? 
or maybe this one here. Yeah, let's copy that one. So if we do copy, no, nope, if we select that, get off, get off. I don't want that. There we go. There we go. If we select this one and then copy that, there we go. That's what we want to do. And then we can start building with these things. Um, does it have the door on the front? Yes, it does. So I'm thinking maybe we'd put that door on the other side and get a little entranceway built here. Just a start, but what do you reckon? I'm quite liking the look of this. And then we can start putting some park rides in there. Let's see what's uh, been unlocked. So we've got the gate, we've got the side entrance, and we've got the amusement park, another side gate. Oh, we've got some of these plazas. I love these things. Let's have, uh, when you walk in right up against there, we'll have a couple of these. And hopefully they're nicely lined up with each other. Yes, they are. Look at those. So you've got some nice park benches and things to sit down when you come in. Let's just follow this in and see what it's like. Yes, it's a bit low, but to be honest, people aren't that tall in this game. <laughs> so that'll be fine. That's cool. And what else have we got? Then we've got amusement park cafes. Amusement park. Yes, we've got loads of stuff. Let's take over these paths with the tree ones. So they can sort of go up to the side here. Like that. And then we could have a cafe and something off of the side there. Oh, that's not quite even, is it? Well, I think I'll straighten this up. Don't worry, I'll do that off camera. Ignore that. I will straighten that up off camera. But I think that is going to be a fantastic amusement park. And then, of course, we've got in here all of our rides that we'll start adding in when they get unlocked. So the swing boat when we get to level three. House of Horrors. What else have we got? Rotating teacups. Yeah, the piggy train. Oh, man, there's some huge stuff in here. So once we get all of this unlocked and much bigger, that'll be fantastic. How are we doing? So we need lots more visitors coming, but we've only just opened it. And you know what? I'm going to make this free as well. Let's make it all free so people can come in and really enjoy our parks. This one is still the main park. As soon as this one hits level 5, we'll make that the main park. And we'll switch over the upgrading to that one. So how far do we have to go? Oh, we are so close. Do you know what? Let's hang around and get this upgraded. Yay! You've just hit Busy Town. Excellent. We now have sightseeing, bus tours, more unique buildings, oil, tourism, all sorts of policies. Boost Connections is a good one. That gives even more people coming to visit your city. All sorts of new roads. We'll skip through all of those. Loads of new buildings. Oh my goodness, so much. Oh my goodness me. Right, and what's the next level to get to? 8,000. We're almost there. I've leveled this thing out. It's now nice and square. And I think that is looking pretty, pretty cool. I've put another little side entrance over the back here just to help people get in and out from this side. And I've put a fence around and just expanded a little bit over here just to try and help grow the city because we need to. And also quite interesting, you can make these get taller. If we look over here, if I do Control z to undo... There we go. It's a bit smaller. So if you hold that, and then you can use that one there, or it's Control h And then it goes white, then you click on there, and it makes it the same height, which is fantastic. So, yep, yeah, we're almost at level 5 for this park. Let's have a look. What are we up to? Let's come out of Move It Mod. 9,453. We're nearly there.
So we've had all the vis visitors, but our entertainment is just not high enough. So we need to add some of the new things that have been unlocked to get this entertainment value up. We had this kiddies climbing frame. Let's see what that does for us. One. Oh, we're so close. We are so close. There we go. That's been added in there. What else do we have? We might need to just repeat one of the things that we've got already. Let's put another restroom in right next to this. There we go. That's certainly going to help, I reckon. 1,051. Oh, my goodness me. We're so close. I reckon another one of these because people absolutely love this park pier. Go on. Let's add another park pier in. We've got room for two right here. <laughs> um, <laughs> or could we could we put it over here? Is it going to let us put it into a, a good spot without looking weird? Well, I'll tell you what, we're going to stick it there, and then we're going to move it mod over to where I want it, which is over here. And then we'll turn that round, spin you right round. There we go, excellent. And then we'll have that in there. And that is looking weird. Okay, so let's do a bit of control H. We want it at the same level as this. Yeah, perfect. There we go. And we'll line that up. I oh, will have to do control H again. Perfect. There we go. Hopefully that still counts. What are we up to? What are we up to? 1098. Oh my goodness me. We are so close. Hooray, we've done it. <laughs> Excellent. I just put one more gazebo down. We have now reached level five and it's given us the trampoline park. Oh, yes. We, there we go. Put that gazebo in. We have our first level five park. What's it unlocked for us? There we go. The trampoline park. Let's pop this in for the kiddies. Where is that going to be a good spot? Maybe just sort of over here in this little section. Looks quite good. Let's try that. There it is. In the middle of the trees. And, of course, I've got prop and tree anarchy on. So, if we turn that off, we can fix it. Don't worry. We'll just do that. There we go. Nice. Little chirpy. <laughs> chirpy trampoline park. And then it comes with its free kiddies already jumping around on the trampoline. And that's our first level 5 park. That is absolutely fantastic. And that's really made cool use of that space. And let's have a look at the land value around here is not too bad it's, it's higher there because that's at the water's edge but certainly the happiness is up really really high over here and it all gives the same boost as a normal park as well i'm liking that i'm liking that so if you want to be back to see the culmination of our amusement park it's going to be a lot bigger than just this maybe have another castle down there we'll put another path through the middle here we shall see what we can do let me know in the comments what you think hit the big b with the t stain to subscribe and i will see you all tomorrow take care thanks for watching bye bye